Hello. What's up, everyone? How's it going? That was a song from Jumping Flash 1, which is appropriate, because today we're about to play its damn sequel. Now, I don't know if you guys remember when we last played, but uh, I had a little special someone show up, and I think they might be knocking on my door right now. Hello! Oh my Hello. goodness! What an exciting, uh... Hello. Hi. Hi. <laughs> How's it going? Uh, yeah, so Jess and I, well, mainly just me, I'm gonna be playing Jumpin' Flash 2, but Jess loves these games, and I've never played this one. I played the first one, so it should be good to, to try it for the first time. So, yeah. j Jess, this, uh, this game is like a, a one-setting thing. We can knock it out in like two hours, right, you said? Uh, yeah, should be able to. Cool. Uh, it's pretty short. But yeah, I'm just gonna dive right in, because I got the game right here. Yay! Are you ready happy, happy, happy. to jump and flash? That I mean, that is the object of the game, so I would assume that's what we're doing. Lol. Lol? But yeah, how are you, Jess? Uh, I'm alright, how are you? I've been pretty decent. I, uh, I ran some errands today, and now I'm, I'm streaming. I might... Go hang out with some friends after, so. Yay! Yay! Happy, happy, happy. It is a happy world. Exact. Is that the name of the studio that made these? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Exact made uh, a game called Geograph Seal uh, mm. that was like a prototype for Jumping Flash. Uh, and then Sony saw that and scooped them up and said, make stuff for the PlayStation. And that's what these games are. I see. That makes sense. There's Baron Aloha. Yeah, he's evil. He is evil, but he's not that evil in this one. Also, I cannot hear the game audio. Oh, you can't? Like OBS. Yeah. Okay. Uh, That's I, whatever. It seems a little quiet on the stream end as well. I can crank it a little bit. I mean, it's not like that would make a difference for you, but... They made two Japan-only games in the series. Yeah, Robert Mondu. Oh, and fuck Pocket this Moo -Moo. guy. I forgot about the the big. Uh, what is this person's name? This character? Captain Kabuki. Captain uh, Kabuki. I really do not like the English voice for this character. <laughs> I think this has always been like a icky sort of thing. I mean, you know, it's just fucking dub voice acting of the late '90s. That's kind of what you get. Yeah. We never got the third game in English. I, yeah, so it seems. I, I'm pretty sure you played all of the Jumping Flash games, right, Jess? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I love Robert Mondew. Uh, I played that game a whole bunch. Uh, game audio is low. All right, let me crank it real quick. Just real yeah, quick. touch it up. Um, Robert Mondew is a weird, weird sequel. Um, this plays basically exactly like the original. Uh, Mondu is like a weird mission based thing. I love it, but it's it's a very slow paced thing in comparison. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh that doesn't seem that much but I'm gonna crank it up even more. We'll do it we'll do it up to forty five. That should be good. Okay. Yeah, no that's better. Let's fucking go! Let's play. I'm excited to see my friend Robert again. Robert has a new voice. Wait, he Robert's does? excited to see you and show off his wonderful new dark, deep voice. There's a new voice? Mm-hmm. Oh, boy. What does he sound like? Hold on. Yeah, I mean, you'll figure it out. Save the Moo Moo's. I love the Moo Moo's. Moo Moo's are such a funny... Oh, he doesn't sound nearly as fun anymore. Yeah, no, it sucks. Let's uh, do always... it. Let's do it. I hate whenever, like... Like video games turn characters into like a like a cool guy instead of a silly creature, you know? Yeah, but I mean, I, I kind of like it because I, I think the idea is that you have um, like an AI companion in the game that yeah, emits yeah. that voice actually. Uh, we talked so about like... that last time, yeah. Like the Robin's voice is not actually the robot; it's like a little guy inside of him. Yeah, which is funny. which I think is very cute. So. I don't know. I'm I'm all I'm all right with it. So this time we're saving the Moo Moos instead of the carrot pods. Yeah, I love the Moo Moos. Uh, when you get up close to them, they go Moo Moo. Wait, do they? Hold on. Hold yeah, on. yeah. Stand by them for a minute. Moo Moo. 
<laughs> they totally do. <laughs> That's awesome. I love these guys. Since the last time we played, uh, Wendy surprised me with a little gift and gave, uh, fucking sent me a, a plush of one of these guys. Oh yeah, uh, yeah, for your birthday. I got, yeah. got you a little Moo Moo. They're relatively cheap as far as like old obscure plushes go, you know? Yeah. Uh, it was a, it was one of the sweetest things I've ever gotten in the mail, so I, I very much appreciate it. Oh, as I'm the world's like jumping it. flash. Uh, You're the world's, like, one of maybe six Jumping Flash fans. <laughs> I'd yeah. like to consider myself on that list these days, but I don't know. I'm, I'm kind you of gotta, a fake fan. Yeah, you haven't even finished two, let alone fucking Pocket Moo Moo, let alone... Robert Mondu. Uh, I gotta play them all. Yeah. Man. Moo you, Moo! You can probably skip Pocket Moo Moo. <laughs> what is Pocket Moo Moo? Pocket Moo Moo is like a mini game collection. Oh god! That, uh, I thought I added more junk. Oh, I thought dullard. I added more junk. Dullard. Um, no, Pocket Moo Moo is like for the Sony Pocket Station, which okay. was like their VMU Tamagotchi thing. Right, so it's just right. a mini game collection, like a disc for your PlayStation, but then you hook up to that and like play through the games on both systems. It's a funky, weirdo game. That is weird. Wait, where is the Moo Moo? There he is. I always forget that in this game you gotta be quick about your jumps. If you if you spend too much time in between your jumps, you you get fucked over. Yeah. No, that's what the uh so this game has a few UI changes. Um uh that oh, I see. To the, right? That's really yeah, handy. That's, yeah, it's super nice. It's like insane that the first game doesn't have it, kind of. Okay. Yeah, this game, this game still got that that crusty frame rate that that we love about the first one. Yeah. So. Uh, you, Wendy was uh, worried about streaming it to me on, on Discord, right? And it was just like, I think the 15 frame, <laughs> I, I don't think that's gonna be too much of. How an many issue frames with this. do you think this game runs at? I imagine, I think this one might run at a slightly higher frame rate than the first, mm -hmm. but um. I would still say it's got to be like 20 frames a second or something. I, I wouldn't know off the top of my head though. I, I'm very bad with frame rate shit. Yeah, I, I can u almost never tell with frame rate stuff. It's fully yeah. unlocked, can run at 60 FPS. Can it? That's uh, crazy. I don't know how to unlock it, but. Yummy. I, yeah, you'd need like. Yummy! Is what he just said there. Yummy! <laughs> yeah, overclocking the CPU would be, is how you do that. It's, My tummy like, is so full. Oh, delicious carrots. <laughs> <laughs> I think that in Jumping Flash 3, Robert should... Oh, what the hell? What the hell? What the hell? I clicked out. Evil uh, gamer. Evil gamer? What the hell? I should have known. I should have known. I, uh, I think okay. in Jumping Flash 3, uh, Robert should be like a real, uh, like an organic bio matter, like machine, and like he eats the carrots, they're real carrots. Huh? What do you think? Uh, I mean, I guess that's one way to take it. Wow. Well, Fix a can. <laughs> you can just say you don't like it, you can just say I'm, I'm stupid. Yeah, well, you are kind of dumb. Alright. Wow. This is gonna. I think that Jess shame. has public overstayed her stream. welcome. <laughs> I think maybe it's time to go solo with this no, one. No, no, no! Right. I'm showy! I'm showy! Oh, I can't stay mad at you. Mm. Mm. <laughs> what was that? What That's was that noise? Grinning. That's a big grin. Mm. Showing mm. my teeth at you. Mm. <laughs> Alright, well, let's, let's fucking destroy this Captain Kabuki. Oh, but you have a little more. You have a few more stages before you can do it. Well, I can do it. It's gonna happen. Moo moo! Moo moo! This stage has my favorite song in the game. Uh, speed run time. Girls out here being silly and goofy. This is just what it's like when Jess and I start talking. Yeah, we, we get, get silly stupid. mode. We go Opa stupid we have, we have talked to each other for so long that only it's, it's like we speak a separate language. Also, I can fucking shoot in this game. I just re <laughs> I haven't yeah, been yeah, cheating yeah. at all. <laughs> Oops. 
It's easy to forget, because, like, you definitely, your best attack is to just, like, land from really high up on a nerf. I like to jump. Yeah, it's, I mean, it's called oh, jumping spinning. flash, not shooting flash. That's true. That's true. I would be a little bit pissed off. Oh, you fucking oh. kiwi. It almost killed me. I would be a little <laughs> pissed if it were called shooting flash, because I don't like shooting in my game. I think that's uh... unethical. I think it's fun that you can kill and uh, take pictures and stuff. You can th yeah, that's true. I guess that's shooting in that way, like, you know, yeah. with a camera. That's kind Ever of Ever cool. heard of Pokeon Snap? I love that game. Yeah, I've never, you never played, played it. it. Yeah, it's, it looks dumb, looks gay as hell. It's a pretty <laughs> gay little game, but yeah. I, I, I like it for its gayness, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Moo, moo! Wait, moo, what moo! That palm tree was in my damn way. I don't like gay little games. I, I only want to play stuff that says boo boo. Yeah, yeah. This is. This, I think this might be the straightest game in existence. Chat. What are your favorite straight games? Yes. <laughs> only only straight answers allowed, please. Yummy. Jumping flash to the squeak wall. I think that would have probably been a better title. Yeah. Big I, Trouble in Little Moose, a little whatever. I was about to say, I, I actually really, really like that name. It's it's, it's, it's an incredible subtitle. Big Trouble so in stupid. Little Moose. Fucking referencing that John Carpenter movie. It's so insane. <laughs> that's that's absolutely the localization team's doing. Yeah, I don't. What is what is it in Japanese? I, let me let me look up. Let me look into this. Further research needs to be done. Is Pikmin straight? I hate to break it to you, but that's the gayest game I've ever seen yeah, in my that, life. Yeah, that's a little... Now I this mean, game... On, Did you even have to ask about that? This game is for boys. This game is for boys. You can tell by the character's voice. Yeah, Yummy. exactly. <laughs> Yummy. All right. Ready to go? Wait, the when, you, when you fall in the stage, it's such a funny, like, scream. <laughs> okay, I'll keep an eye out for that. Yeah, yeah, check that out. That Moomin Game Boy Color Game is gay as hell. I've never- there's a Moomin Game Boy yeah, Color Game? Gay Boy this. Color? Gay- uh, lol? Koma Sadise lol? That sounds funny. Let's do it. I don't know anything about Moomin other than they- they look like that. Yeah, I should know the about boss. them. They look cool. Oh my god, it's like Aubrey. Aubrey? We're fighting Aubrey right now. Oh, that's true, because it's a shark. That's a funny. Shark, cool. Oh my god, Aubrey just fucking took a chunk out of my skull. Oh yeah, she that was take scary. A bite. Pretty true to life. Oh Lola? my god, the missiles. Okay. Lola? Lola? Is this Pac Man? Yeah, that's what I'm playing right now. Oh my god. <laughs> Pac-Man got crazy in the in the fifth generation. <laughs> <laughs> they really need to re like to rebrand the, the franchise that the you know. Yeah. Come on, don't that's that. That's that. That's that. <laughs> he sounds like fucking Roger Craig Smith oh. a little bit. <laughs> Whoa! Kale. A stupid shark! I killed that thing! <laughs> I'm gonna <laughs> fucking kill it. that shark! Well, alright! Um, that just happened. No copyright law in the universe can stop me! I fucking- my boyfriend, he was, uh, he showed me a clip from regular show today. Uh, oh, yeah, <laughs> Roger Craig Smith is all up in that. Yeah, show. did you know that Roger he's, he's Craig like Smith character. is, like, every background character? <laughs> <laughs> it's really funny, and, like, apparently there's, like, a Jamaican guy that he voiced, and it's like, oh, God, oh, Roger. I don't remember that one. <laughs> <laughs> it's really bad. It's like, Roger, you, you voiced Sonic. You should be better than this. I don't think that, like, voicing Sonic means that you get to, like, a free ride on, like, I, I don't think that I that expect means better like from better. Sonic. Yeah. I expect better. Sonic I... wouldn't do that accent. Sonic wouldn't be racist. Sonic wouldn't do this. It's not in his heart. It's not in his nature. Oh, this level is cool. Yeah, this one's really cute. I love this game's music, by the way. 
I yeah. what would you say has a better soundtrack, the first game Two. or the second? Okay. I think that I think like one has like some tracks that I really like. Um, specifically like four dash one and two. Those are really good. Um, but like this game, I'm kind of I'm kind of like jiggling my head. I'm bobbing around mm -hmm, uh, mm -hmm. to this music, you know. I like the little oh. rock, the little the little rock pathway. Cute. Yeah, it's cute. It's cute. It's cute. It is so kawaii. Kawaii dice. I remember hearing John DiMaggio in Fahrenheit and he voices some ra racist Asian character. I feel like it is like a rite of passage to be a voice actor in the 2000, early 2000s and not have voiced a, a character that's a little racist. I feel like that's just that's just an inevitability. Wait, it's a rite of passage to not do that or to to, to do that? that. Like okay, I feel like I, every I every that, single sure. voice actor yeah. has like every white voice actor ever. If you you're not in the business until you've done like one thing that Another. could maybe get passed around on Twitter and make you look bad. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> one left. Oh my God! I got three moo moos, and there's one over there. Moo 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 moo. Um, I was going to look something up. What was I looking up? We were talking about the game's music and... No, the title, the title. I was, that was Oh, right, 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 right. I'm so stupid. They, my name's literally stupid. Aw. I think your name is QT. Aw, oh, wait. Wait, that's like, um, character in Space Dandy. There's a character named QT. Yeah, the robot. Oh, wait, yeah, that's cute. I've never seen Space Dandy. Do you think I'd like it? Uh, I think you could, yeah. I think okay. it's definitely- I love it a lot. We should watch it sometime. Yeah, that sounds sick. Um, where is the exit? Is the question? Oh, it's over here. It's the orange yeah. cube. Yeah, yeah. That's such a nice quality of life thing in this dish one. So the radar is better? I should- I should, uh... Take a take a closer look then. Yeah, get your papers on that thing. My eyeballs are locked All on. Right. All right. Space Dandy is so cool. Truth. I uh, I'd be interested. I feel like there was there was a brief period of time where I would have been too much of a prude to like it, but now I think I've like wrapped back around to being mega not a prude. So yeah, I, I, I think, think you're I'd annoying like enough to like it. <laughs> True, true. <laughs> a perv, yeah. A perv? Uh, yeah, I always, anytime I see one, I'm always like, ah, you pervert! That, I mean, that, that used to be my, my, my username on all, all, uh, platforms. The, the pasty The gaming perv. pervert. The gaming pervert. Hey everyone, the gaming pervert here. Today we're gonna be <laughs> reviewing Sonic 06, and man, what a stinker! <laughs> Sega, did you even try with this one? See, this is where we hit our stride in the stream, where we just start talking about camera views. <laughs> <laughs> that's how you know. That's how you know that we've like settled in once we start talking about Nitro Rad. Oh God. Now this is fucking awesome. This gives me um, like there's a place in fucking LSD Dream Emulator that has this exact same sort of. I mean, obviously it's a fucking, it's a Japanese house. That's the idea, but like. I don't know, it's just the rendered in the same kind of way. The PS1. Yeah, it's that PlayStation. PlayStation type beat dungeon crawler level. Dandy has the same energy as Lupin the Third, and I just want to shove his face in a locker. That's cool. I like Dandy a lot more than Lupin. Uh, Lupin, personally. I also have never been that much of a Lupin head. I, I feel like I could like Lupin. Yummy. It's it's pretty cool. It's just like uh Whoa. Well I'm underwater. Oh, yeah. This game has much better like underwater visual effects and that kind of this thing. This is cool. Yeah. LC is and... such a weird game. That would make a pretty decent stream game, I feel. Yeah, you should do that next time you're sick. Next time I'm fucking on drugs. Oh, oh, oh. Drug stream. Where are the moomoos? Um, go that way. Oh, I see. Yeah, the radar don't help too much in a 
in a maze. Yeah, yeah. How, how many maze levels we got in this one? Because there's uh, like two or three in the first. There's two in the first and there's two in this that okay. follows the exact same structure. At least this one has like a cool theme to it. Yeah, it's instead of just like, it's Egypt. Oh, have you ever been in a pyramid in a video game? I don't think I have. Oh, no, that's that sounds strange. Wow, what mischief could be going on in there? <laughs> <laughs> what sort of mummy or creature will we find? <laughs> what mummy is this? I think that two, like, the second game in a series always got the better locales because it's like we fucking can't do desert and, and like, grass again. We gotta, we gotta be a little more creative with it, you know? Yeah. I think this game does a lot to, like, push the world of Jumping Flash in a weird, stupid way. Because, mm -hmm. like, you know, this plot being, like, Baron Aloha calls his, the guy who beat him up last game Yeah, help. yeah, I, I love Baron Aloha, and I especially love him here. I love his little antics with the one movement. Yeah. This stupid spaceship helicopter These thing. spiders suck. I don't know how to kill yeah, them. Yeah, you don't have to kill them. You can just run past. There's the exit. I only got one moon move. Uncharted 2 Among Thieves has the same thing. I haven't actually played the Uncharted games. Uh, I think that's the one movie game I could learn to tolerate. Uncharted. Yeah. What if it was called Uncharted, though? Well, okay, well, then I'd love it even more, of course. Oh, truth, of course. truth, truth. <laughs> these guys are awesome. <laughs> yeah, I do, knew you'd love these Do guys. they have, like, names? Somewhere. I don't know what they are, though. I would love to, like become a Jumping Flash lore expert and to learn, like, all of the funny little names that they have, you know? <laughs> Let me... Next These guys are there. Peeping Pete's. Peeping Pete's? That's pretty good. Uh... Okay, well, I think I gotta go backwards, because I missed some damn moomoos. Yeah, you definitely missed some guys. Uh, this stage can be a little annoying for that on your first time. Okay. Uh, well. Like, I don't remember... I, I feel so bad being like, I don't know if I can help you on this, because it's just the thing where I... I go through it, and I just sort of... I just know it, but I don't... I couldn't tell Yeah, anything. yeah, no, that that's sort of just sort of, like, what do you even call it? Just the second like hand... muscle memory Muscle memory, thing. yeah. Muscle man memory, a regular hey, show. Bro. No way, bro. Bro, I love jumping flash. <laughs> Dude, I don't you know, want to play your weird know. game. No, bro. jumping flash is not weird, bro. <laughs> that you're way better at muscle man <laughs> than me. I don't have a muscle man in me to to channel. Are all I, levels I think... pretty short? Yeah, they are. Yeah. This game is tiny, and that's why it's so, so sweet. I love a game that's like 30 minutes long. If a game takes more than one sitting to get through, I am probably not going to finish it, which is why these <laughs> yeah. guys sit so highly in my brain. I, I totally understand that. I, I, I feel like I got some kind of ADHD or something with video games. Like, I, especially in like, the older I get, the less patience I have for yeah. stuff that I haven't, like, either already played or, like, am familiar with. Yeah, I or totally get that. Like, I, I feel like if I had, like, at least, like, with your stream or something, it's like, oh, I can make it a series to play something. Yeah, know? yeah. I, honestly, like, I hope that in the future I can use my streams as an excuse to just play stuff that I've been meaning to, you know? Yeah. I mean, I guess that's kind of what I did here. I have I've been meaning to play Jumping Flash too. So. Yeah, since we've been friends, it's been like a decade, basically. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Not a decade. I played Jumping Flash 1 when I was like 17, right? And uh, yeah, I that sounds probably right. So it has been six years in the making. Yay. Yay. I know a lot of people with ADHD use streaming as a means to force themselves to play games. Okay, so I'm not alone. Yeah, maybe I should start streaming. Hey, that would be fun. I think you would be an entertaining stream more. I would just sit there and I'd get shy and I'd say like five words the entire stream. Aww. <laughs>
Some people are into that though. They're like, oh, this is this is so chill. That's what, what a... when you don't talk, people are like, oh man, your stream is so chill. So, <laughs> so chill. He's such a, a cute, shy little girl. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> a, a you are literally babe? so. Like video game? You are literally so moe. Oh, you're literally so mo from The Simpsons. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. Shy Sundere girl. Truth, truth, truth. All right. I did it. She's, She's so, so anime. anime. <laughs> <laughs> She's so kawaii. I can't deny. What the fuck is that? <laughs> Lead Street Boys. You don't know Lead Street Boys? I don't. I don't know it by heart. I. You've oh, definitely man. shown it to me. Okay. I love After the Leech this stage, we'll put on Leech Three Blood. <laughs> <laughs> That's something that I would do. But the only problem is, is that you would not be able to hear it. Only the stream yeah. would. So it's like it's it's, it's kind of <laughs> pointless. Watching. You'll just see what other captions. people in the chat <laughs> are saying. Jump up, like do your double jump to get a, a higher. All right. Jump I always forget that does more damage. Yeah, it's cool. You also have your firework attacks. Oh, yeah! Uh, what are my thoughts on a toy princess? Uh, was that one of Exact's games? I feel like that totally was. I feel like I played that. Uh, got him. What?! No, yeah, you got no, me, I... actually. Okay, so I, I went through one... Uh, like, a few years ago and played through all of their sharp pick x68000 games uh i don't remember this one super well though uh, i i remember really liking the one that was um uh it was like a you, you play you like control a mech and you have like a grapple hook that game oh, was fuck really this guy. cool fuck this guy uh, but i don't remember i don't remember this one so so well i should play it again Oh, dude. No Nudgeach. Hey, Wikipedia is describing it as, uh... This beam. Reminiscent of Kiki, Kai Kai, Twinkle Tail, and The Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening. Twinkle <laughs> so Tail? That sounds Kiki, awesome. Kiki, Kai Kai, Twinkle Tail. What an awesome fucking game. Yeah, Aqualess. That game's so fucking cool. I would... I would smoke that game up. Hey, do you get a life on, on, uh... Oh. Hero? Uh, I think so. Okay. I, I don't I don't really die in this game, so. Yeah, yeah, you're I, too I, good I at it. I wouldn't, I wouldn't know. Um, but if you do see the game over screen, it's kind of cute. Hmm, hmm. I will I will consider it. Oh god. God no. Ass. What the hell? <laughs> what, what the hell? <laughs> okay. Okay. Ah! Yeah, this one's a little hard. This one, this one's, uh, you're gonna lose some health, too. Oh god, oh god. No, dude. Please, god. I must stay alive, I must stay alive. No! Goodbye, Cruel World! That seems like it might be game over. Yeah, that's a game over for sure. Damn. Do I no. have to redo the world? Maybe they changed the game over. Yeah, I think you do. Oh, I should have saved be. It's gonna be a lot. It's gonna be a lot faster. You're gonna be powerful. You're gonna be warrior. Okay, I will be warrior. But I will save state next time. Okay, cheater. Loser. I will cheat. But only in the service of time because I'm not good at video games. Yeah, these this stream's already gonna be fucking short. <laughs> Just play through it. Okay, times. fair enough. <laughs> no, no save state. Do whatever. I mean, it, like, I don't know how, how many worlds are in this game again. Four, six. Uh, six. That's right. This game shows what it's like to be five four. Oh, Except wow. right now you're fucking huge. You're like jumping on buildings. And Robert stuff. is like massive. It, it yeah, kind of like, like messes with me big. how how big he is. He feels like he should be a little guy, but he's not at all. 
Robin. Yeah, I love that Robin's like secretly kind of big. The Robin in Robin Mondu is smaller. Oh, is he? He's yeah. a yellow Robin, right? He's a yellow Robin. I think he looks good in yellow. Yeah, I like him. Oh. I think I probably said that last time, but you know, if you ever get to Robin Mondu, I'll get to say it, and, and people will be like. I, I feel still like can't fucking see him because he's not on the thing because it's first person. I feel like I will play Robin Mondu eventually. One of these. Yeah, days. that's like a that's like a three years into streaming, you'll come back to it. <laughs> Save states are so valid. I wouldn't finish games without them. Yeah, especially older yeah. games. I'll be honest. I'm I'm in that 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 like contrary and annoying camp of like uh lives and video games are not that cool. Sometimes they can be. Sometimes they genuinely can be, but a lot of times they just kind of get in the way of, of me experiencing a game personally. Yeah, no, that's that's pretty pretty fair. Now you get that one. How do I get to that? You jump. Right. That's right. So I've heard. Oh. Wait, CV64, you had to use save save. What's CV64? I think most people don't like lives anymore. Yeah, I, I still see the value in certain games. I feel like if a game is like well designed around the live system, it can be cool, but... Well, yeah, I mean like an Anilin type thing, like an arcade Yeah, type, yeah. You know. Castlevania 64, okay. But yeah, I would definitely be using save states on that. That game's a little... Little I, I just would never play that game. <laughs> yeah, I would oh, smoke. Right. I would smoke it for a bit. See what's up. <laughs> Taking some of its toxins. <laughs> Get a good whiff. I Get like that it. Castlevania smell. It's a. Uh, I mean, it's neat. I, I think it's got a mood. I think about the fucking title screen of that game, which has the character with the the fucking violin playing. Yeah. Yeah, I, that's cool. I, I feel like the game's aesthetic is like ingrained into my brain. There's a yeah. moo. There's a moo. -moo. There's... So many moo moos. Oh, so Twink little Dracula. time. Yeah. Twink Dracula. Yeah, he's Dracula's he's Dracula, a what? He's a no way. I think you've already missed one because that's the X one. Well, no, I was so. gonna go back. Okay. Okay. All right. Sure. Oh wait, but they are in order. That's interesting. Yeah, that's actually um, true of the first game as well. Uh, but the fact that they hold up big E X I T signs is really funny. They should in Jumping Flash Three. They should add two more collectibles, and it spells Brexit. That'd be cool. They should add. They should add one that says Dexit, and it's like a Pokemon thing. Oh Yummy. yeah, it's like fuck you, game freak. <laughs> With a, like, a jab that's way too fucking late. <laughs> Bring back national decks. I feel like I've kind of gotten that out of my system at this point. It's really fine. Really, I just want those games to actually, like, be high quality more than Genuinely, anything. Genuinely, I, I have the controversial opinion of I could have never cared if they added the, had kept the national decks. Uh, I, I feel like it's cool that each game could have like a, a much more limited set of cool monsters yeah i mean i feel like the way to do that is like keep returning pokemon like in, in my perfect world i would i would have a fucking just unique pokedex of pokemon every time like yeah, with exactly. maybe a few returning pokemon in like the post game or something but like otherwise yeah but they would never do that because their old guys are too marketable yeah exactly you're the eye. Okay. I I think that really I just like them using that as an excuse to still release a kind of underbaked, unfinished video game was a little silly, but otherwise it was whatever. Car. Got them all. Got them all. Let's go, Tails. <laughs> All right, I'm already back. Right. We are so back. See, didn't even take that long. Still gonna save state though, I imagine. Cause you're an idiot. Cause you're st 
50. I will save state if I get one more click. Okay. Otherwise, I won't need it. Because what, this is going to be first try. You have powers, you have abilities. That's the thing, you only get one firework. You have three. I know. But oh, you only yeah, get yeah. it when you when you respawn. Right, 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 right. I, I, I Dr. Dullard for a second there, I'm sorry. Oh, Dr. Dullard. Dr. Dullard, he's like a professional idiot. <laughs> oh god. This beam sucks. And the fire sucks. The blue fire also sucks. You remember to shoot, because you're not All right. using your, sh your shooting power. My shooting power? This is like an upgrade of some sort. <laughs> I got one. What up? Yeah, I got an extra life. Damn. You're so right. strong. Yeah. You're so capable. Oh I'm God. not a scrawny twink in real life. I'm a big robot. I'm not a scrawny twink. I'm not a scrawny twink. Stop! Stop! Ugh. Whatever you're saying about me, it's not true because I'm not a scrawny twink. <laughs> Amazonian Wendy art. I don't know about that one. Oh, it's you. Scrawny twink, scrawny twink. Blushes. I gotta say, watching these in fucking silence, <laughs> they don't quite hit for me. <laughs> it just kinda... Kinda looks like pictures, I imagine. Oh, they move a little bit. When he's the Windows permanent... apartment is only big enough for one Amazonian. Whoa. Wow. Oh my. Oh me, oh my. When he's like a true. friendly living scarecrow. What is that supposed to mean? <laughs> like, it's I. He scare crows away. That's true. Ravens and crows do get very, very afraid of me. That's probably because I'm, I, I am constantly going, I'm going to kill all crows, I'm going to kill all crows when I walk. <laughs> I'm gonna fucking kill these crows! I'm gonna kill them! I would never do that, actually, because I like crows a lot. They're my favorite bird. Did you know? Is that true? Yeah. I didn't know they were your favorite. They're one of my favorites. They're just what so pretty. Top five birds. Top five. Oh god. Okay. Um, crows, in no particular order. Crows, uh, juncos, blue jays. Junkos, cool. And okay, cool. you love Mordecai. Uh horned owl. And horned owl. Mm, Budgie. Budgie. No, cockatiel, cockatiel. Okay, this is a pretty good list. Bird tier list. Yeah, let's uh let's do that. Let's stop the stream and do go on tier maker. I'm sure there's a good bird tier <laughs> list. I have a, a huge fondness for the kill deer. Uh, kill deer? It, it, I don't yeah, know if I've heard that one. No, I've, I've told you about them before. They're little little birds that, like, the oh, moms right, 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 right. away from their nest. Yeah, they, they're, they're like... They pretend they have, like, an injury, and they, like, lead you away and pretend to be all that's weak so and badass. people. That's so badass. And then you get close to them, and they fly away. It's cute. Can I walk on these? Yeah. I was like terrified of, of like falling through these as a kid. It really seems like you should. Yeah. But, you know. Robert's just kind of huge. Just so fucking large. Okay. Um. Seems like I gotta go up. That's probably true. You do have jumping abilities. And you can go really high in this game. You can go up in a flash in this game. Whoa. Wow! 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 European robins are- oh yeah, robins are up there as well. Yeah, the robins, robins are cool. Woodpeckers are also really cool. There are just so many different cool kinds of birds. Gulls? I love gulls. I love the yeah. sound that gulls make. Yeah, they're assholes though. They are, but like, they kind of got- cool all birds kind of gotta be assholes. That's why they're yeah. so resilient. 
On yours are pretty sweet. Okay. Wait, what? Um... Check, please? Use your jumping abilities. I suppose I can, except when I do that. Yeah, that's your falling ability. And it's not quite as useful here. Let's just say I'm not being very gamer right now. Yummy. Uh, yeah, me. Certainly being gay, I don't know about the mer. Cool. It's so why is gay such a fun fun word to say derogatorily? <laughs> there's like there's gotta be a, a psychology to it. I'm serious. Yeah, I mean, I would say that uh, for a, a lot of folks out there, there's a saying it loud type <laughs> type fun to it, you know? Oh, god uh, damn it! What the hell? Speaking of gay, you know, look at Yeah, this. this is kind of, uh... Just keep this away from my kids, thank you. Yeah! <laughs> this is why I turned out like I am. Wendy homophobic. Sometimes when it's really funny. Only when it's <laughs> really, really funny. Or at least kinda funny. Or at least, yeah. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Or at least kind of funny. Yeah. I recently uh, came out as bisexual for the third time in my life, so I hope you're, wow, you're proud of me. Yeah, I know. Can no, I jump over that. there? Uh, to where? To that platform and like in the oh, distance. Probably just turn around. Just turn, jump up to that one. Just, like, oh my god. Go up back up there. Okay. And then jump up to the. I was not thinking. Yeah, that's pretty fucking obvious. Um, I don't need your sass right now, Jezebel. Because what? gay people have a degradation kink. That, you yeah, know that what? That's, that's literally it, yeah. Is there just one Moo Moo up here? Yeah. Oh my god! Yummy. Where's the last Moo Moo then? Um, go back down. Yummy. Now you exploded that guy, so that's pretty cool. Yeah, that was cool. Um, Felt good. Wait, actually, if you stand on the exit thing, it'll tell you where he oh, is. Oh, wait. Oh, right, 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 right. I forgot that's a thing you can do. Yeah. I think that was added in this one. I'm, I don't remember. No, wait, you just saw it. What? He's up there. To the To the right, to the right, to the right. To the right. Oh, how do I? Oh, I gotta get back up. Yeah, sorry. Um, <sighs> not forgiven. Spicy likey. Oh my Hello. god, what's up? It's other Windy, aka Luggy. How's it going? Welcome to world. Welcome to the smile. <laughs> it, it's kind of dorky, but we were we were talking about it. It's like we gotta make sure uh, we we can stream on a day when Luggy can come. <laughs> we know she's gonna be into this. Uh, where was it? Uh, keep going the way you were going. Like, uh, yeah, this way. This way. Aha. Y'all are too sweet. sweet. Smiles. I love Smiles smile. and grins. That rope is annoying. What the hell? I don't like this rope at all. Well, just jump over it. You two are the knights bitches. The knights <laughs> bitches. Yeah, that's, that's basically what... how we became friends was just talking about knights. That's true. The knights bitches is your official name in canon. All right. <laughs> Blushes. Well, that was that. And that was that. Onward to the next level. That this is one what he is sounds like. Cool. This level is kind of, kind of, kind of cool, but also might have a pride moment in there. Oh so God! Be on the lookout for that. Oh, okay. we'll see. Five Nights at Freddy's. What about it? I mean, I agree, but like, I, I just, just don't, don't get, it. get it. Why would you wanna stay? Five freaking nights at Freddy's. Bye, 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 bye. New song I, yeah, that should be the new Living like Tombstone song. 
<laughs> I think that'll go over real well with the kids. Yeah, this their location and <laughs> song's going crazy right now. Did he ever make a sister location song? No, I think he stopped at four. Yeah. Which, like... Imagine, like, fucking enough. striking gold with that. Like, you could have just kept milking that forever. And it would have been... that is the, one of the most respectable things to be like, I did it for the first four. I think I'm, I'm out. Yeah, no, I, I get it. But, like, think of the money. <laughs> Probably you they wouldn't even make that They did do a sister location? Much. Oh, wait. Damn. What? Did they oh. do a security breach song? Surely not. You How do I get over there? To me. I mean, do it if you want. I don't. Oh wait, I think well, I'm see. I think I see street. what you're talking about. <laughs> yeah, this is hmm. not very epic. <laughs> Anyone feeling a little unepic right now? Anyone else getting embarrassed for the developers right now? I can't believe that the woke agenda made them put this in their game. <laughs> Folks, this is... This is Biden's fault. <laughs> Pervert Gamer signing out. Oh, thank you, Luggy. Thank you for sending me the Living Tombstone Sister Location song. I can't fix you. FNAF Sister Location Sister Location song. Okay, here we go. Oh my god, it's a, it's a, a, a Plucky Pete. Plucky Pete! Can't be beat! Okay. I like these guys, what are they? <laughs> They're like little funny. characters. <laughs> He's like a character? You guys seen Guy Sees Grinch for the first time video? That's a classic. Incredible video. Life-changing video. I fucking love Nathan Hare. He's a he's an icon. He deserves more love, I think. Yummy. Wendy reacts to jumping flash for the first time. Oh my <laughs> god! He's like a he's like a character. Robit. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, rob it. That's awesome. Yeah, that was my impression of the of a funnier video. No, it's good. It's good. Okay. I'm getting the fourth moon moon. Right now. Nitro bad. I think you might hurt his feeling with that one. <laughs> Got them all. Okay. Jump and go. Jumping Flash. Now that's a game. <laughs> Brady and I used to play Jumping Flash. Yeah, it's kind of got this whole mechanic where you can jump and jump again. It's like the the game that invented double jumps, I think. I, I was I probably think. an earlier <laughs> game, but you know, it's the one that really popularized it. Uh, all that said, let's put this in the system and go. All right. <laughs> that was incredible. <laughs> now that's a game. I love Nitro. Rap yeah, man, Russia. I never really played the second one, though, but, so it's gonna be interesting to give it a try here. I'm curious to see what they changed. I never hear people talk about the sequel. The original has sort of a PlayStation classic uh, launch title thing. But the, the, what am I talking about? If I'm stupid. <laughs> it's Nitro Rat. <laughs> well, Nitro Rat is. Have you flashed it all yet? I'm pretty sure this, what, what I'm what doing I right now so is... Well. It's so, you, literally the easiest... You have no idea. Like... Sometimes when I'm just actually like reminiscing about a thing, I genuinely I, like inadvertently start doing the Nitro Rad voice and people keep making fun of me for it. It's just an unreasonably good impression of Nitro Rad. <laughs> Sometimes we bear a burden. I, I can I can do a really good uh Raz Raz from Psychonauts apparently. 
That's what people oh, said yeah. yesterday. Let me hear it. It'll be alright, Dogen. I can't do it when I'm all put on the spot is the problem. With impressions, like, I feel like as soon as I'm expected to do it, and then I can no longer do it. I used to be able to do a really good sheen from Jimmy Neutron voice, and then people were, like, people in my friend group from when I was 17 was like, do the sheen voice, and then I lost it. It was performance anxiety. Damn. That's so sad. I can't do it anymore. <laughs> Logie wants to hear the Steven. Oh, I do. <laughs> Garnet! Garnet! <laughs> We got a Steven Universe, and these are my people. <laughs> Steven Universe, and these are my people. We got to stop the combine. You can't save Beach City. It's ruined. <laughs> That's a Miss Steven Universe. It's all hopeless. We're gonna it's all die. gone. Pearl, <laughs> Pearl, onion is dead. Onion sprouted. He's good. He's holding. <laughs> He's getting too big. I love Steven Universe. What a It's what a, a great show. It's just a really easy show to make fun of. <laughs> yeah, it is incredibly easy to like just dunk on so hard. Oh god, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you! I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it. I did it. Anti-racism PSA. I forgot about that. That was like, oh, right. yeah, 20, 2018 they made that. Oh yeah, it was like, Girl, stop being racist! Something Girl, like that, right? you need to quit it! These words that you use are not ethical! You're hurting, their, you're hurting people's feelings! I like how Captain Kabuki just like talks gaily at you for a few seconds. Yeah. It's conditioning. <laughs> <laughs> it's condition yeah, this is what if my dad saw me playing this at a young age, he'd be like, I don't I don't think this is a, this is healthy. I don't think you should be playing this one. I don't think my dad saw me play this one. He he knew a lot about Jumping Flash One. Like he had bought that game himself. Uh, but I don't think he, he ever watched two gay video game. Yeah, maybe this game isn't as straight as we thought it was. No, it's pretty straight. You're I'm right. <laughs> Looking at the Rainbow Text World 4-1. People got so mad about Garnet explaining why racism is bad. Did they? I mean, that makes sense. People of course got mad they at did. that show for anything, and especially if it was just... That has to have had, like, some fucking... Oh, this is forced diversity type. Yeah, That's absolutely. All talking about it. Winnie the Pooh is awesome. True. True. Why? But why? Moo Moo. Moo Moo. Moo Moo is awesome. Moo Moo is awesome. Not yet. Moo Moo for me is like such a wonderful creature. Like up there with like Nitopian as like funny. Yeah, yeah. I I do love me Nito. Barry, Barry, you there? Where is Barry? There he is. Do a little oh. clip. Oh my God, he's so talented. I know, I know. I got. I literally struck gold. Getting him from the game I grumps. Struck was, gold. <laughs> getting him from the game grumps was one of the most expensive uh, transactions I've ever made in my life. And yet it was so worth it. Well, they weren't using him anymore, so I just figured, you know. Oh yeah, he was kind of sitting in storage, like. He, in the back yeah, room. they put him in. It was really unethical, and now he has a nice home. And he gets fed gumdrops every day. <laughs> Wait, you bought Barry? Yeah, yeah. I it's I don't like to talk about it, but I, I mean, I I had to do what I had to do. I needed an <laughs> editor. They weren't using him, so I figured I I sent him an offer via DM, and they they were like, well. I suppose we'll, we'll let him go for a few thousand. <laughs> oh, I've said too much already. I don't want to specify how much he was, but it was it was a lot. Let's just say it was Let's not just... chump change, okay? <laughs> it was grump change. Oh, lol. Lol. <laughs> One left. Wendy walks up to Barry in a suit and shades. 
I don't think Wendy could pull off wearing a suit. I don't think Wendy would ever wear a suit in the, these modern eras. That's the nicest thing you've ever said to me. That's weird. I feel like I've definitely said nicer things, but probably not. <laughs> probably just meant to at some point and felt good about myself. <laughs> <laughs> Can you two do a sick Game Grumps intro? Okay, who's Grump and who's not so Grump then? Well, okay, so you're... I feel like in the in the normal world, I'm probably a little grumpier than you. Yes, yeah. But you're the main host of this, and Not So Grump has changed before. That's true. So I would... Maybe we could do, like, a guest Grump thing. <laughs> so I'm Grump and Not So Grump? I feel yeah, like that's a little be... unfair. I feel like you could be Not So Grump. Okay. Yeah, which one of- okay, well that's actually true. Which one ends up getting cancelled? They both kind of did, but like, one of them definitely did. Yeah, that's true. And I feel like you're closer on that end. Okay, okay, so then I- <laughs> Then I, I- this is so- this that's is so difficult. Fun. There's oh like, God. no clear-cut answer of who's grump and who's not to grump here. You can't believe Jesse slapped Wendy's wife. You should do that. <laughs> <laughs> Where is the fucking last pod? Oh, uh, he's beneath, beneath you. I'm pretty sure. Or maybe just go to the exit. I'll go to the and exit. Alright, you know what? We're just gonna we're gonna decide it. I'm grump, you're not so grump, ready? Okay. Hey, I'm grump! I'm not so grump! And we're and the baby grumps. grumps! The fucking D sick made that impossible. <laughs> That's awesome. That was the I shittiest game grumps intro I've ever heard. <laughs> Pretty good. Well, well, uh. I didn't even look. I went to the fucking exit and I was too preoccupied. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> that was like a real oh, man oh scream. God. Yeah, it's awesome. It's so great. This game rocks. I'm having yeah, genuinely so, so much cool. fun. I love this game so dearly. Uh. Two, I think, is just better than one, mm. but, like, one is, like, both of them are just so cute, you know? I feel like they, this is kind of a game where, like, if I if I got an itch to play them, I might just go for them back to back, you know? It's no, like... literally, yeah, that's, that's like, that's the cool thing about them, is that they, they basically are, like, just part one, part two type shit, yeah, you know? Yeah. I, it is, like, shocking to me that they never released, like, a collection that just had the two together. Yeah, that would've been cool. Jumping Flash Remake? How would you feel about a Jumping Flash Remake? I mean, I'm kind of the person who always is like, I don't really want to see, like, yeah. old shit come back every time. But I would definitely have to... I would I would be lying if I wasn't, like... Mm, you just want to see back. Jumping Flash anything at this point, I want right? to see Robin. I want to... I want to... I want a little figurine of a rabbit so bad, and there are a couple out there in the world, but they're not like for sale or anything, so I'll never get one. I could 3D print one, but 3D printing looks kind of icky. Uh, so IDK. Hmm, I've seen some pretty cool 3D prints. Yeah, yo mama. I uh, <laughs> Well, true. Your mom was 3D printed. Oh, up top. High five me. Can I get a high five chat? I'm not gonna high five when you just insult my mom. Uh, I was asking chat, so why don't you just... Um, yeah. awkward. Okay. Anyways. Where is it? It's behind you. It's that way. No. Look at the radar. Oh, it's the orange thing. I see. Yeah. The blinky. This is the drama that killed Game Grumps. <laughs> <laughs> a yo mama joke that was fucking nothing. <laughs> What's up, Nine Hearts? Welcome to stream. Welcome. My wife is 3D printed. That's impressive. How much did that cost you? I don't I know where I'm supposed to be going. Just thank you. 3D printed PlayStation models are neat. I'd have to find somebody who's extracted like the PlayStation model because that would be kind of cool. Uh, there's like a really good like uh, like Robit Mondu Robit uh, model floating around that somebody made, and I always wanted to get that. 
3D printed. I swear to god, I'm going insane. I can't find this last one. Uh, go back to the start of the level. I mean, that's obviously, like, easier said than done, but I think it's go this way. But I think I, I'm in, like, the general direction it's supposed to be, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, yeah, it's just off to the side, so keep going this way and then go to the right. Okay. He's over on, on a floating platform over that way. Oh shit, there's like an elevator. Wow. You love elevators. Yes, this is true. So keep going. Oh, I see it. And it, yeah, it's gonna be over there. It's so out of the way. How do I get over there? Just jump. Jump onto those cranes and then jump onto that little platform. Oh, okay, it's not that far. And then there's like an, a, the floating like oil tanker or whatever over there. Floating mother base. Man, this is crazy. It should be over there. There it is. Yeah, there he is. That's supposed to be the first one, too, I'm pretty oh, sure. Oh, God. It's just like... <laughs> How was I supposed to see? Whoa, 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 what's attacking me? Oh, God. Oh, yeah, that guy. Okay, uh, go to the go to the left. There's a, a little thing that will we'll shoot you back. Ah. Here? No, the... This. The, ex the, the thingy. Yeah. The thingy. Whoa! Sorry. No, it's okay. I'm kind of stupid in my vernacular. I'm gonna survive. I'm gonna survive. Uh, exit. This is what I need now. Yeah, you'll be fine. Ain't nothing gonna hurt you. Ain't nothing gonna bring you down. Now we're gonna give you a... I saw somebody made a plush of Robin. Uh, there... So yeah, I'm sure if somebody's made one... There also was, like, one from the 90s or whatever. Yeah, I tried but... to get you that one for your birthday, but it was way too expensive. Yeah, it's, oh, like, right. way expensive, and it's kind of, like, they, those guys are falling apart. Um... I'm going to head out, but thanks for the stream. Thanks for stopping by. Yeah. Which you can Pikmin type for could get it? I don't know, man. I don't want to fuck a Pikmin. They're too small. They're too small. They're creatures. They're little animal creatures. Oh, I know it might be rude, but who's your friend? That's not rude at all. That's my friend Jess, and she's wonderful. Hi. Oh my god, my I'm fucking Jess. health carried over. That was weird. I've never noticed that before. Yeah, I think it's usually not like an issue. I think it gives you a little bit of a health boost, so if yeah. you're like, uh, you know, just a little bit of damage, you're, you're Is back there a way to get sense. more health? Uh, yeah, they're like the... You'll find little help. The like little carrot icons on the spinning, the the the. Ah. Uh... Robert, you gotta go pick up your phone. <laughs> what? Cool. That's true. I don't. Know. Finding iPhone. Here Finding we go. IPhone. Here we go. iPhone adventure. iPhone adventure. Selecting iPhone. iPhone Blast. iPhone Blast. iPhone alert. iPhone alert. <laughs> warning, warning. A powerful light has <laughs> entered the area. Oh, there's some help. Yeah, yeah, Jumping Flash sequel on iPhone. Download now from the App Store. Only on Apple Arcade. We got Jumping Flash 3. Would you get Apple Arcade for that? Uh, I have to get an apple thing but, oh yeah, yeah that would be fucking wasn't there a game that you wanted to play yeah, air that twister was... i air wanted to twister. play yu suzuki's brand new title air twister similar to it looks like panzer dragoon which isn't a game that yu suzuki worked on but I, I i wanted to smoke that game so bad but it's coming out like next month on pc so well, there I'm, you go. I'm fine but uh, it's like a year late video games were so bad like a year ago Stop. And now I'm late. Damn. I can't wow, seem to get these. Vision. <laughs> <laughs> True. I can't seem to get these doors open. Am I doing something wrong? Uh, only the ones with a logo you can oh, uh, okay, uh, right. open. But go back. Yeah, just go down this hallway and go through that elevator. Got it. Oh, this is an elevator. Oh my god. Yeah. Wait, is this? Oh, it's Baron Aloha! 
Yeah. His work. His life's work. Hi, hi. What's up, Pops? Pops. Oh, these guys are funny. The TV guys. Yeah, I love the TV guys. They're in the first one. I think I remember them, yeah. Yeah. Okay. So this is the only other maze level? Yeah, after this you're cool. done. They're not even that bad. They're like fine. Yeah, yeah no, I actually, I kind of like them. I think that as like a... It breaks up the gameplay well enough, I guess. Yeah. I think they could definitely be a little better, um, but like, they, they ain't bad. The music is awesome. Yeah, yeah. I love the Jumping Flash soundtrack. This game is They're fucking both... sickness. It's giving me That's a sickness. That's true. I actually have a bit of a cold because of this game. I'm actually like, I'm gonna go to the doctor after this because oh, I'm wow. so sick, bro. That's not true. I'm lying. Well, I thought I was a very convincing lie for what it's worth. Does Jess have a Sona? I was thinking of drawing you two with Robert and some Moo Moo's. Aww. It's very sweet. Uh, yeah, I do. It's basically... Uh, didn't you do some art? I did. Uh, I can... Oh, it's for the thumbnail. Uh... I could probably find it real quick. And whatever. Uh, I can I can find it. It, it. It's in the thumbnail of slash the opening of my first jumping flash stream. Yeah, if you can find that, then that's it. I, I wish that I had like a more readily available. Here, I, I got uh, I got soda. you. I know how to, I know exactly where to find it. Okay. Uh, da, da, da. Thank you. Yeah, it's no problem. Your videos where it's the jumping flash with Jesh. Yeah, Jesh. this was Hello. we did this in June and now it's October. That's been fucking three months crazy. Uh, yeah, no. <laughs> so the the we've uh we've been meaning to get to this for a while. It's just like for how open both of our schedules are, it's insane how like there both of is. us were like Oh it's me, hello. I'm gonna put this in the Discord. Just for a reference, so it can stay. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, da, 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 da. But like for how open both of our schedules are, it's like insane. There are so many times with this where it's like, uh, that day's not gonna work for me. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, this one's not gonna work for me. It's just so funny. That's how it, how it happens. We still gotta play nights. That's the big thing. Yeah. True. Why is this not working? I will add it from my downloads. So I can get back to the video game. Boom. I used to Boom. add it to my downloads. I know when that download rings. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. We're, we're Christmas creative. is coming up too. That's true. Christmas night's gonna. I be feel like that's perfect. I kind it kind of did like it. It just sort of We've worked out perfectly. We've waited long enough that yeah. we can do a Christmas nights thing. Yeah, sure. Uh. Did I go the right way or the wrong way? I fucking uh, missed a movement. I'm never gonna yeah. forgive myself again. No, you didn't miss him, you just went the wrong way. Christmas nights is hella short. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I think what it would be is like... Night if, and a little bonus we, yeah. Christmas. Nights would probably... I don't know. Because you're you've played nights before, so it's yeah. not gonna be that long. So I feel like it would probably, probably be two just streams, if I had to guess. Yeah. So like one or two streams, and then the second stream has Christmas yeah. nights in it. I think that's fine. I think yeah, that'll work. I'll be good. We'll shoot for December yeah. for that then. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I have a bunch of shit. Not a bunch of shit, but there's some stuff. I did promise to do a Yaoi classroom stream. For, what the hell for does Christmas. that mean? I... I think it was it was a bit that got very out of hand. I promised that I would do a lecture, like a college style lecture on the Yaoi, the history of it, and like like the 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 pitfalls of the genre, what to look for, and my personal recommendations, that sort okay. of thing. Okay. Well, I a guess comprehensive maybe I should, guide. Maybe I should tune in for this. <laughs> You're so much. You have such a Yaoi brain that I can't follow, and this might help me. Do a video essay on Yaoi. I feel like at this point, I kind of have to also include Yuri in this, you know? It's kind of got to be a, a, a just an all-comprehensive, all-inclusive guide to this 
Oh, well, I mean, the garbage. two are definitely different. Though. They are different. Hmm. Maybe Yuri will be a separate stream. Maybe that <laughs> will be... That's the next Christmas. Next Christmas we'll do Yuri. I do we'll need to, to scope there, down too. this project a little bit. Yuri of Wind? Yes, dude! <laughs> Gaming mysteries! We'll get Yowie of Wind on this one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the brother of Yuri of Wind, Yowie of Wind. <laughs> Show those skinny white boys kissing. See, I'm gonna be talking a lot about how I hate that they're skinny white boys all the time. I think that we need more diversity in the yaoi space. Yeah, like green. Yeah, maybe boys. some green boys. Still can't believe that Yuri of Wind's in Yik. Yeah, that's so insane. He's in Yik? He, what? Yeah, he voices Rory. What? Uh, like, that's how I learned about that game. Is no he way! The last time ago that he was... I'm gonna be voicing a character in a game. That's fucking and awesome. I had no idea. I was not even. I don't think I was following Yuri of Wind by the time he said that shit. No, I, I don't think I was either, so I have no idea how the fuck I remember this. And I, I could not tell you what video that was, would have been in. The Grinch, somebody says in all caps. Yeah, I think the Grinch should be in the Yaoi. <laughs> oh, green? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He looks like Rory too. Does it? I mean, I bet he does. I haven't seen a picture of him. I don't think. But like, I think I, I, I can picture. I can he's got long imagine. hair. Yeah. Betty's experiencing twink death right now. What? What? I don't know. He's like he's like twenty nine. He's like thirty. That's the beginning of twink death, you know. I I mean I'm just sort of looking off to the side. Like yeah, I know what. But I guess I should have known what twink death means. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I might have to really come to this lecture. <laughs> Grinch x Rory. Isn't there like, in Yik, can't you like make out with every character in that game or something? There's like game game files for like you kissing every character. I remember seeing that somewhere. I, I don't remember. Yeah, I'm sure that's probably in there. If you, if you heard that, that's probably a thing. Fuck this. You can door. try to kiss Rory. So it's lucky. Okay. Okay. Uh, knowing those two characters, I doubt that would go very well. <laughs> Hello. Um, check please. <laughs> Fuck. No, right when oh, I- he, he calls you gay if you try and do it, that's funny. I feel that's like so Rory- weird. Rory kind of has gay energy about him, though, from what I- from his yeah, character. Yeah, but he's design. not gonna tell you about it. He's not- he oh doesn't my think he does. Dude, 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 kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him. There we go. Yeah, there you go. You killed Spidor. Alright! Stage clear. I like when he does that little, like, tilt upwards that he does at the end. Yeah, it's cool. I don't know why he's doing it, but he does. I do like that the main character of Yik is so hated, they had to add a mute option just for him. Is that real? Yeah, kinda. I mean, okay, so, like, they... I love so much about how, like, Yik has tried to change itself. I love that it's fucking... It has like the. Here's the mode that doesn't have him over explain everything. Oh. <laughs> Which is just really funny. Um, and it still is like pretty lengthy and verbose, but. <laughs> The, the so new weird. update is is like one of its main things is that it's just trying to make his inner dialogue scenes look cooler. Um, That's so funny! God, I'm like. <laughs> <laughs> I, I genuinely actually kind of uh, like it. Uh, no, I I, I, I get up. it. I like. Go on. It's just funny. That's all. That's all. It's just like there's so many stupid things. I, yeah, I like things. just like the idea of somebody dedicating their life to like not being called cringe. Like they want their thing they made to be not cringe so bad that they're like, okay, all right, all right, I'm releasing an update that changes everything. Well, I, 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 that's a little harsh on it. Damn. I'm sorry. No. I'm sorry. It's <laughs> <laughs> whatever. It's just like. <laughs> I mean, that's I, just I, the I vibe like I the get. Fallout, yeah. The fallout of like having your character who's supposed to be an asshole 
be called out as being an asshole. Yeah, but, like, no, I do so get that. So overbearingly so that it's like. I mean, I guess I gotta tone it down or fix it in a way, you know? Yik uh, is trying to fix all the issues, and I respect that. I also just wonder, like... If it's worth it. Who who are they fixing it for? Like, the They're handful of Yik fans? Me. Yeah, for for the people who like it, I guess. Which is admirable. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, I think... I, think I, I still feel like I'm kind of set in my hater brain waves from 2017 or whatever, you know? Sure. Yeah, I mean, it's it's... It's a stupid game in a lot of ways. Um, God damn it. Yik is the best, worst piece of media ever, and it continues oh with God. each update. Uh, yeah, kinda. I mean, I think there's just so much uh, genuinely cool ideas in there set alongside some of the most, like, I guess I'll figure out how to like that or how to, like, put up with it ideas. Um,. It's up its own ass so much, but it's also kind of like, you know. Whoa, this it's is like roller coaster. Trying. Yeah, it's cool. I love roller coaster. A lot of likers of the game do in an ironic sense. Yeah, that's what it seems like. I will say, I think the visual design is cool. It kind of yeah. gets that low poly stuff. Like, like, it did it before I feel like the low-poly craze really got going, you know, too. Yeah, I think it, like, it looked, I still like how it looks. I think some of the, like, modeling things about the game is, uh, weird. I hate when you see the character's teeth, for example. <laughs> um, but, like, other than that, I really actually like the garish color palette. I like the, like, constant, fr uh, si like, frame animation that the that like all of the characters move in i think that looks really good mm -hmm. I, I remember some people saying that it looked fucking ugly for that and that's just like that's mean it looked cool in fucking quake and it looks cool here yeah yeah no i get that i'm never gonna get this this is evil that they made you me can just that. jump and stop and then wait for it to loop around no i'm never gonna get it it's just not possible. They made it impossible. I like this level a lot. Yeah, it's cool. This series loves its amusement parks. For it really time. does. There is a fucking whole world dedicated. Is this another amusement park world? The uh, the song for the first level in this world is like, "Hello, amu hello again, amusement park." <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Yeah, it's very cute. I love when, like, soundtracks just have shit like that. Fucking Mario RPG's soundtrack is, is like, the road ahead is dangerous. Should we be careful? Like, shit like that is, is very <laughs> charming to me. Yeah. Amusement parks are really good fits for platformers and shooters because you can easily contextualize all the silly tropes of the genre in it. Yeah, that's, that's true. true. I think especially with, like, Jumping Flash just having, like, abstract imagery floating around, like, it Hello. kind of hits that, like, oh, early 3D-isms in a lot of ways. And, like, I don't know. It's cool. Pocket Moo Moo, like, <laughs> you're also, like, you're playing fucking tiny little micro games, but also building up an amusement park. It's so <laughs> stupid. Whoever, whoever fucking was the brainchild of Jumping Flash just must have loved a good amusement park. <laughs> yeah, for real. There he is. Is he moving? Yeah, he's on a little magic carpet. Moo moo! Hello. Oh, he was like, he was grinning at me. He was grinning because, like, you saved me. Yeah, he's happy. He loves That's you. That's so sweet. Right. Guys, my dog totally won a costume contest. Your dog was in a costume contest? What was his costume? Yeah, what would you dress him as? The best world in Tui is Witchy World. You know, something fucked up. I like Banjo Kazooie a lot. I have never played Tui. I really should one of these days, but I hear it's bad. Everybody that I that I know who I care about their opinions says Tui sucks and you shouldn't bother with it. 
I found a copy of Tui in a fucking barn uh, a while back. <laughs> I've been meaning to play it, but I really don't like Banjo Kazooie. Um, so I, I, I kind of feel like it's I should replay that and get a better opinion of it before hopping into that. Maybe one. so. Maybe so. Two's not bad. It's just too big. Yeah, that's kind of a problem see, that's with, kind with of a problem ukulele. With one for me. <laughs> I feel like one is manageable, but I also understand it. Like I feel like it's a very acquired taste, you know? Yeah. Jesse, hater of Banjo Kazooie. I don't like Rareware's games. I think yeah. they're all like way too long and like genuinely the thing I said about like the game's got to be like beatable in like one or two settings for me to finish it. I think that's the issue with all of their games. They're just a little too long for me. Mm -hmm. they, they all feel a little like uh, padded, I guess. Far too padded. Banjo 1 ain't, ain't too bad for that, but like... Just doesn't like DKC? How do you uh, feel DKC, about DKC? DKC is like... I like those games, but I really have a hard time with them. Uh, the hitboxes and stuff yeah, yeah. to the sprites. If those games got like a widescreen release, uh, I would feel a lot better about them just so you could see the enemies coming up ahead. I think that they have some bullshit enemy placement that people just don't like talking about. Um, and other than that, they're pretty cool. Also, three is stupid. I, <laughs> I love like three. three. I love stupid. three. It's I it's both. fucking stupid, but that's why I like it. You know. Yeah, you have to remember, Wendy. I played three on the fucking GBA version and with oh, the God. redone soundtrack. Yeah, and like, yeah. <laughs> the redone graphics and like Jesus. genuinely playing through that game felt like, is this a joke? Is this <laughs> game a fucking joke? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, that game is a joke. I mean, I I feel like in kind of the way that people who love Yik also like it ironically, I almost feel like that's kind of my enjoyment of Rare's games. Like, I, I there is some genuine enjoyment, obviously, but a lot of it is like, man, this game fucking blows and I love it. I love <laughs> yeah, how stupid this game really is. They blow in really fun ways. They, they all are made with a lot of love. 3 even has, like, some really fun ideas with its overworld and stuff, right? But, like... Damn. <laughs> um, DKC3 is underrated. I feel like... I think it's rated pretty pretty, fairly. pretty evenly. I, a lot of people oh, hate God. it, and a lot of people say that it's actually, like... You know, it's actually pretty cool, and I think that's that's pretty fair. Yeah. I'd say it um, is, it is, what's the word? It's contentious. Yeah. I think it's... That's all right. Like, it's... If it weren't the follow-up to 1 and 2, then I think it would just be a, a pretty phenomenal game, right? But, like, yeah. in comparison, it sits a little funky to next to them. 2 I is don't easily even the agree. peak of, of that, that series, I think. 2 is, is like, the most fun, but I think I, I like 1's visual design a lot more. 2 just gets a little bit icky and gross uh, with yeah, how much I it's that. gremlin stuff. Uh, 1 is so basic, but it's also, like... I don't know, it's cool. Sometimes that that flavor of vanilla is what you want from a from a game. You know, like I, yeah. I, I feel like sometimes sequels can be equally detrimental in some ways of like sometimes you get really creative and inventive like new takes on it, but also sometimes it can just deviate a little too far. Yeah. Tro technically Tropical Freeze is peak. I agree. Tropical Freeze okay, is yeah. a phenomenal, incredible game, but that's not a rareware game. That's so. true. That's true. Uh, There's a new move. Yeah, yeah, like, a lot of them run bad, like, um, that's, I don't really, I, I said this earlier, I don't have a too much of an issue with, like, frame rate stuff, but, like, it can really hurt a game sometimes. I don't think it does for Jumping Flash, uh, or anything, but, like, you know, uh, <laughs> Oh, I might have fucked myself. I, I feel like Tui, like, coming to a crawl sometimes is, like, icky. How do I get up um, there? Uh, oh, I'm back. At, I'm at the exit. Um, there's like a cannon somewhere that'll shoot you up. The 360 versions of those games fix that. Yeah, but like, you gotta have a 360, you know? Uh, I, it's like, 
I don't have one. And I would love I, it I if they did a rare replay release on PC or something. Cause like, yeah, they have a they have a lot of like updated versions of those games. They're just not very accessible unless you have like an Xbox proper. Yeah, it's solvable via emulation, which is what I've done. Yeah, but I don't know. It's just like. I already don't really like these games that much, you know? It's yeah, I just, I, I feel like, like, expecting everyone to, like, want to put in the effort to, like, be like, I'm gonna get all the right patches for this game. I'm gonna get it in widescreen. I'm gonna get the mods. And, like, that's just a huge ask of, of yeah. everyone. You know, especially, yeah, especially if you're not that invested like, in the game I just want to try itself. it out again. Yeah. yeah. But, I mean, it's also not that bad. Xbox Live. Yeah, true. That is live. <laughs> Perfect Dark also has the PC port. Perfect Dark is a is a funky one. Uh, I did play that a little bit as a kid. Um, that game's kind of cool. I, I don't have too many notes about that game. I, I haven't played it enough to really say anything. It doesn't hold my attention, but it's it's like fine. Perfect Dark Zero. I, I played as a kid did as well. You? That game is fucking stupid. <laughs> I, I did not like that one. Uh, Let's see. That game, it feels like a fake game. That one, like, <laughs> something about its UI and the way that it moves feels like fake FPS game in a movie. I can see that. Where is the last movement? I had my sights on him for a minute there. Uh, I think he's probably to the other side, because he already got the one on the... True. It was in Dev Hell for ages. Yeah, I, I remember hearing that. Admittedly, my rareware dev knowledge ain't that deep because I don't like their games. Why did but... Microsoft buy Rare? That seems well, like the least compatible brand for their their whole. I think deal. they're like a Western studio. They had a, a good hold in like the platformer genre and like multi, you know. Like, just you. good, multi-talented studio when they were just starting Xbox. So, it, it makes sense to me, but, like, it does seem like, damn, they could have grabbed, like, anyone else, right? Yeah. <laughs> hmm. Yummy. Yummy. Yummy! Is that the cannon? Uh, sure, yeah. What? I jumped! Whatever. Okay, well, there's a cannon there, so you're good. Probably tried to also hit Nintendo. Oh, there it is. Yeah. Yeah, that's also. I'm true. pretty sure they literally did, right? They literally were like, hey, make make games for Xbox. That's that's literally something that happened, and they were just like, fuck you. No, that's stupid. We're not doing it. No, dude. I swear you, to you're God. Gonna fine. You're going to be fine. <laughs> oh my God. Thank you! Thank you so much! I did not want to have to redo that! <laughs> oh my god. Activision was going to purchase them. I, I didn't know about that. That would have been fucking weird. I mean, Activision yeah. was purchasing a lot of weird shit at the time that they just kind of threw away and discarded. Yeah. Okay, so I need to get over here. Use your jumping ability. I'm going this way. The, that would have been awful. They would have been dead by now. Yeah, for sure. Uh, okay. They're still dead now. Yeah, How that's also kind of true. Uh, you can jump on the hand with the cards and then jump to them. Oh look, it's him! Yeah! It's my boy, Baron Aloha. And the Moo Moo King card over there is cool too. Aha, uh -huh. I see. Whoa, or Knight or whoa, whatever. Whoa. Judge Jester. Come on. Got him. A rare read here. Viva Pinata. I haven't played Viva Pinata. I haven't either. I hear it's good. I mean, yeah. they made some kind of okay games show. while they were bought by Rare. Just kind of... They made Grabbed by the Ghoulies. That's true. Some people actually like that game. I've, I've never played it, so I don't know if My... it's good. But... 
it doesn't look very good. My childhood friend talked about it as like, yeah, grabbed by the ghoulies. I remember that just because <laughs> like had played it once. And she she just had this like big like just such a reverence for this thing. That was, like, Who are these brothers? The clown oh, brothers. <laughs> the clown brothers. I love these guys. I sure Rad would play that game. That's true. Grabbed by the ghoulies. Ah, now I that's know much a game. About this one. <laughs> that's a game. I love every game. Is like, ah, oh, now that's a that's game. a game. Is are they hurting me? Uh, I mean, you don't seem to be up. anymore. Yeah, I think you're good. Seems like when they spin, it's no good. Yeah. Yeah. Shoot them off their damn balls. Right. Yeah, Xbox definitely was not the audience for that kind of game. And that's what's so fun about the original Xbox, just having like a sort of weirder um, library because it's like, well, we got to figure out what the audience for Xbox is. Yeah, know? yeah. I mean, building a platform from the ground up definitely was like, what the fuck do we do? Yeah hit the ball out of the park with fucking uh, Halo. Yeah. And those, it's like Without a, a Halo, I don't think they would have fucking done anything for themselves. You know? Yeah. Would have been like a, a more, maybe more of a curiosity. That was like the, the thing that was like, damn, dude, you gotta get Halo. Yeah, they published uh, a lot of cool, weird little games. Got him. Find him. I played Sonic Heroes on PS2 as a kid. That's right. apparently the worst version, but uh, <laughs> I played it. I played like the first level, lost the disc, and it was had this image of like the lost Sonic game in my head for years. Cool. Project Gotham Racing was that a hit? I... <laughs> I've never heard of this. Game. Yeah, I don't. Re I don't remember Project Gotham Racing. Uh, I haven't known a lot of people with Xboxes. I I feel I like you would have heard about that one. one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but, uh, you know, it's like Forza Racing Series. Okay. Oh, I see. It could it could just be that the people I know didn't, didn't have. Yeah, I mean, Forza is like a huge franchise for a series that, like, I feel like nobody ever talks about. <laughs> I know people talked about, like, Forza Horizon. Oh, yeah. or something I, remember that. I don't really remember what some of those are kind of cool actually I have a friend who like got really into it and bought like a recently and bought like a fucking uh like steering wheel car set up for his this living room and it was like damn this That's is insane crazy. my yeah. brother also really likes Forza. I don't know I just can't imagine playing a racing game where the whole thing is like this is as real as it can possibly get you know yeah no, it's it's not for me. And like playing those games and like sitting in the cockpit and every or you know sitting in the driver's seat and everything, it's like this still doesn't feel like an actual car I want to drive. This still feels like fucked up and weird. Yeah, yeah. That might just be like. I mean, I'm just a no, car I'm... hater in general, so I it does nothing for me, you know. I personally like driving. I'm a, I'm a little bit of the driver. Aw. So good for you. God damn it. The Forza Horizon oh sub-series is more arcadey. So I've heard. So I've heard. Yeah. Got him. Got him. They should make a game about racing and Mario. That's so true, though. When are they doing that? Like a Mario, like, realistic racer would be fucking crazy. <laughs> Imagine driving a, a Ferrari down the Mushroom Kingdom hills. <laughs> <laughs> this is the most realistic Mario has ever gotten. <laughs> it's fucking Unreal Engine 5, Nintendo hire this man type racing. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be great. Speaking of kart games, Diddy Kong Racing over Mario Kart 64. 
And Crash Team Racing, too. Diddy Kong Racing is okay. Uh, I haven't played it. Never played CTR. Yeah. I've heard people say that CTR is really good, and I'd be probably more willing to check that one out over Diddy <laughs> Kong. Kong. I don't even really... See, Crash I don't also don't really love because he's got that Warner Brother wit to him, but like... <laughs> he totally does! Uh... <laughs> yeah, he's a bit of a Warner Brothers. CTR fucked. That's what I've heard. Mario Kart Unreal. Dude, Mario Kart and Unreal, the series, an Unreal tournament with Mario would be badass. Oh, yeah, yeah. I think that would you, be great. Like, that would you really You could, like, shoot a too. fire flower at Mario and Luigi and Bowser. What if they put Mario in Doom, like the original Doom? <laughs> I feel like I feel like I've seen that wad many, many times. No, I think that this could be something. I think we're on to something. Here. Hey, you know, I think our collab is finally gonna happen. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Why this? This is the we one. We love Mario, and we love Doom. Doom is what if right. they put Mario in uh, Assassin's Creed? Yeah. I think what they should they... just put Mar Mario should just be like it should be a given that he shows up in every video game. You know? Yeah, that should be like a video game thing where it's just like this little Easter egg they throw. A Mario little tip in of the every... hat to Mario fans. Yeah, to to Nintendo Sama for making that <laughs> such a one. Nintendo wonderful Sama. Game. <laughs> I can picture like fucking like the CEO of Activision saying that like you know there's a little a little respectful nod to Nintendo Sama. Which is like such an insane thing to say. <laughs> <laughs> okay. One more moon move. Jump down on exit and see where he's at. I don't know. I don't know which ones you've gotten. I haven't been paying <laughs> shout outs to Nintendo. So. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, it's over here. Yeah, go that way. <laughs> Game with the racist Mario cameos. Don't know that one. Oh, I love racist Mario. The video's awesome, right? Yeah, that's pretty classic. I don't think I've actually. What ever just happened? Said Where's the movie? platform beneath me? Where did it go? Was it moving? What the hell? It was moving. I think. I'm so sorry. That's okay. This stage kind of sucks. I'm just gonna real quick. Get my lives back. Oh, truth, truth, truth. Truth, truth, truth. Yeah, they redid it. So the original game has like a cute little um, rabbit sprite on the game over screen. I remember. And he yeah. looks like he cries and has like mascara or something when he cries. Aww, it's cute. He's a little fruity with that. A little fruity. That's the fruitiest robot I've ever really? seen in my life. I remember always getting angry at the racist Mario thumbnail and like, Mario is not racist. <laughs> That's literally me though. I it was like the yeah. same way. It was like, he's not like that. <laughs> I mean, I, it was a pet peeve of mine as a kid when, like, people would, like, fucking make Mario, like, an asshole. Because, like, his whole character is that he's not an asshole. And I guess that's the joke to people. But I did get, I did get re unreasonably upset about it as a child. I guess child. that's the joke here, but it's just not true. <laughs> it's just not okay. Nintendo-sama. <laughs> Nintendo-sama did not put this in his character. <laughs> so bad dorkly mario see dorkly mario sucks but he's like i get where they're coming from racist mario he's a he's just a foul beast a foul creature a foul creature we haven't gone to any of the bonus stages in this one. Oh wait i forgot there's a damn bonus stage in this game yeah i just remember it mario is not nice he loves his <laughs> wait mario is nice he loves his brother <laughs> Mario is not nice sometimes. <laughs> I think we can all agree, whether you're LGBT or just normal like me, Mario is a beloved character and he should not be slandered in this way. Damn. <laughs> Damn. Invincible. Invincible. That was the most cr like bit crush. Invincible. Invincible. I've ever Delicious. <laughs> Yummy. <laughs> Yummy carrot. The sad thing is that the dorkly Mario sprites were made by a proper sprite artist who was explicitly 
told people to ask permission before using them. Damn, Damn that sucks. Damn, that does suck. I always assumed they just commissioned somebody for it. it. I mean, yeah, they do seem very custom, you know? Like, like very intentional, like, dorkly made this themselves. Uh, yeah. Huh. I wonder why they went with that sprite. Maybe it's just because it wasn't official, I guess, but... I think it, you know, to be fair, it does kind of have a, a slight... a slight grunge to it in the color palette that maybe maybe attracted them to it. <laughs> yeah. Yummy. Darkly Mario is just Peter Griffin Mario. Can I get up from here? Uh... Probably. You, maybe if you stood at the end of that light bulb, you can make it to those plates, but it's gonna be a, a bit of a... a bit of a sticky wicket. I can do it. Oh god. Can I even stand on top of this? Uh, I mean, you'd have to... You'd have to be a little bit of a murder head about it. Nope. It's over. It's not over. Okay, I gotta find a different way. It's so lovely to be in the world. That's true. I'm always saying this. Okay. Why is there just, like, bullshit in this level? This poster, radio... This level is supposed to be where Captain Kabuki lives. This is just Captain Kabuki's house. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> That's fucking awesome. Oh god, okay. Moo, moo! Moo, moo! Captain Kabuki has no floor. Captain Kabuki! just lives in space and floats the fuck around. And just likes to make little toast for himself. Little toast and has a lot of little lamps. Okay. One left. One left. I'm starting to get the shroomment down for this game. You're getting there. I feel like you could really get go crazy. I mean, we've talked about this. Yeah, this game is like one of the most speedrunnable games ever, maybe. There's like a specific thing about... It, it, there's not a whole lot of like tech to it, really, but like... Um, there's a, one thing is like, if you do a two double jump... Or like, if you do your double jump like quickly, you fall faster. Hmm. Um... And so that's, like, good to, like, oh, I'm trying to just, you know, fall faster, I guess. It, it, it's just, like, there's a lot of little things. I didn't things actually know that. A few little things like that. Oh, you totally but, do fall a bit faster when you do it quick. Yeah. It, I, I think this game, like, for being a game with tank controls, feels, like, incredibly Oh, no, it, it's great. It's, it's, like, it just feels... I understand why you... I think we were talking about tank controls the other day, and you're like... No, I... He said tank controls suck. Or maybe that was someone else. I think it was uh, someone else, actually. Yeah, I don't remember this. I think it was d my boyfriend who said that he liked tank controls for some reason. I don't know why. He was thinking the about jumping flash. Yeah, true. Aren't we all... Aren't we all... Any, when I come over, I am gonna get him to play it. I think that would be kind of funny. Yeah, I think he'd like it. He'd, he'd think it's alright. I can definitely hear him go, yeah, it's alright. It's not a real game like Roblox. <laughs> That's true. My fucking boyfriend spends so much time playing Roblox these days. I don't know what to do. I don't he know how to get him to stop. the car crash simulator in Roblox. That's so funny. Does he actually? You would I know mean, better than played, I would. He played it, uh, I watched him, like, for a fucking good while really? just playing it. Uh, <laughs> but I don't know if that was, like, just a, a one or two day thing, or if that's something he keeps coming back to. Roblox and Garden of Ban Ban Couple, true. That, that it's is a, true. It's a toxic household. Yeah, you don't want to be here with our fumes. Alright, that's the level. Yeah. Alright. 
Can a band band girl and a little wasp boy really start early? <laughs> <laughs> it is possible. For those who don't believe, it is possible. You can do it. That was a long one. All right. There now you you've go. got to fight Baron Aloha. Wait, it's two bosses? Oh fuck. Yeah, wait, why do I fight boss. Baron Aloha? Because he's the nice man. Oh wait, this isn't Baron Aloha. I'm sorry, but it is his robot, which I think is cool. This is a callback. Yeah, this yeah. This is the machine. fucking the the pod guys, the guys yeah. who were holding up the the worlds last time. Yeah. I think that that's such an insane little bit of continuity. Yeah, no, this Just... game seems to have like a lot of that, as weird as it is. Yeah. Just was wrong on the internet. True. You can't say that on the internet! They're Garnet! gonna execute you! Gar Garnet! Garnet, stop posting now! Garnet, you need to get I... off the 4 chan! Steven, I've seen all of the possibilities. <laughs> I've, I've oh my been... My, my mind has been awakened. Steven, oh I'm oh <laughs> <laughs> Who is this character? That's not Garnet. Dude, Garnet sucked. <laughs> Garnet if she sucked. <laughs> Steven, I'm I'm feeling I'm, I'm feeling a wee bit. I was just having a go at it. Just having a go, just like <laughs> Amethyst, we have to stop Garnet! This is kind of based. Steven, this is kind of based. <laughs> this racism thing is kind of based. Stop! Stop! Pearl, we have to stop it! They're both too red pill! This is not in your heart! You- This is not normal! <laughs> I just want to fucking take pot shots at this guy. He's scaring the fuck out of me. Hey, yo, pot shots like smoking? Like yeah, weed? yeah, like a little bit of weed on the breath, you know? A pot shot is like weed that you inject, bro. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Oh god. It, what, isn't there like a quick turnaround? No. Oh, okay. There could, there should be. That and be jumping cool. flash three will add that. I have often thought about making my own jumping flash. I mean, who's gonna stop you from from making it? You know. See, here's the thing. They jumping flash is a, is a round just enough that I, I don't think. Uh, you know, it's just uh, it's it's just you can make a fan game all you want, but it's you know. Yeah, you can't make a commercial fan game, obviously, but... Yeah, but man... I want to have my own rock. How... okay. What would your dream Jumping Flash 3 be? Go, go. Uh, okay, so I would want there to be a stage that's like a, like a Little Italy sort of thing. It would have giant grapes that you jump on, and when you jump on them, they squish and send you really high in the air. Okay, cool, uh, cool. I want it to... I want Baron Aloha to be there, because he's not in Robin Mondew, really. Okay. Um, but I also want there to be, I want it to be like a traditional jumping flash game and then it, it, like once you beat it you unlock the uh, the city hall or city service mode which is what like Robit works for in, in Mondu. So I think that that would be like a cute way to like, oh you, you go and back through stages and, and like do like missions for Oh them. that's fun. Uh, but you play as like the, the other Robit. I think that like making them explicitly two different Robins. Yeah! Really cute. That's cute. All right. uh, I did it. Wendy wins. No, I got Wendy one wins. more. Got one more boss before I win. Open world jumping flash. I don't know about that one. I don't like that. I want, <laughs> See, I do like them to be... I, I like them to be sandboxes. I don't want them to be too huge, though. Mm, mm, uh, mm. I don't like... I don't like open world games, truthfully.
uh, which is like the, these games are like close to open world with just like there's not like a set way to get oh to anywhere. Oh my god, I don't have a lot of health to do this. You'll be okay. You'll be powerful. It's Captain Kabuki, but like they're like a. You, you have another life. That's true. I don't know where I got that life. I guess they just gave it to me out of uh, pleasure. Out of pleasure. Out of pleasure. Yes. Um, they were fucking like, like Gundam now or something. That's kind of yeah, cool. It's weird. This fight is also like way too similar to the first game's final boss, in my opinion. Yeah, I, I see that. Oh god. Mecha Kabuki. Truth, truth, truth. I made some pretty good progress for, for fucking half a life bar. Okay. Yeah, okay, safe state. And you have a a killer beam. Yeah. That didn't seem to do not much. help much. Yeah. I so got this. Fuck. Fuck. Yeah, no, I got this one in the back. You're a hero. You're gonna do it. Oh god. This, this one is the hardest thing to dodge at the moment. Yeah. Oh fuck me, but, phase. Uh, you're done with that phase. Oh god, oh god. Goodbye, cruel world. Goodbye, cruel world. Goodbye, cruel world. Okay. I got it down. Going gamer mode right now. Fuck you! Fuck you! Oh, wait, 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 wait. Come on, change. There we go. You've got this. Jesse, can you talk about Ant Dude? I don't have anything to say about <laughs> Ant Dude. He dominated the Jumping Flash 1 stream. I don't Did like we talk him about Ant Dude? I don't yeah, remember talking about it. We talked a lot about Ant Dude. <laughs> I chat on his videos the entire stream. That's I really funny. His vids are just so milk toast. They're so white bread. They're so. But yeah, no, he has nothing to say. He has literally nothing to say. Fuck. Goodbye. What happened cool. with him, dude? Nothing happened with him. He's, he just we got makes beef videos. with him. We got beef. He, See, he, you watch his videos. You don't know. Yeah. I don't watch his videos anymore. I've I've grown up. I've grown up since then. Are yeah, you proud sure of me? You have. Sure you have. Are you proud of me? I'm gonna look through your internet history and, and look at all of the. Ant Dude uh, I don't think you're gonna want to look at my internet history because it might oh, be a little oh. weird. There might be some interesting material in there. <laughs> Anyone else getting really interested right now? Anyone else getting a little bit interested? Uh, with Ant Dude's the Minecraft guy? No, Ant Dude is a Nintendo. No, you're game thinking of player. Ant Venom, different guy. Wendy looks up Ant Dude fanfic. Oh, you got me. You got me.
It's this fucking heart thing that sucks ass. And he's dude, getting hit Mario by it. Odyssey speed, right? No, and that's. <laughs> What's that guy's name? Is that guy? Who? I don't know. There's another guy. That's an ant guy. And he speed runs Mario. Fuck this. You just don't want to get near him. Goodbye, cool world. Goodbye, cool world. Goodbye, cool world. Wait, you can prop potentially stay on top of him. I didn't even think about that. Yeah. Like that. Oh, well, no. Oh, well, not like that, you idiot. You dullard. You absolute buffoon. You absolute... Pretty little buffoon. Aww. Do you mean it? Sure. <laughs> Stop moving around. I do think he's covered a few things other people don't. But he's not that different from guys like Scott the Waz. That's fair. I just feel like he doesn't bring an energy to his videos that I, I particularly enjoy. Yeah. That's all there I'm is. I'm sure he is a nice him. man. I don't... Yeah, he's probably cool. He likes Kirby. Kirby seems cool. I, I haven't played a lot of those games, but they seem kind of cool. Oh, what am I expected to do here? Uh, this guy's fucking up. tough. Yeah, mm -hmm. Captain Kabuki may be a fruit, but <laughs> actually a fruit with a bite. I would... Yeah. Well, well, anyone else getting interested right now? <laughs> That's saying terrorist attacks like 9-11 to say guys like Scott the Wars. That's a really funny comparison. <laughs> <laughs> That's all That's super fucking cool. <laughs> terrorist attacks like 9-11. Good lord. <laughs> God damn it. I just need to, like, take less damage in this part. You're still fine. Arlo is the one you dislike most. I, that's a... I love yeah, Arlo. I'm, I'm an Arlo lover. I'm a... You know, I have watched a, a fair few... Uh, Ant dude videos just because like it's whatever. I don't watch his stuff, but like I've I've seen him. I do. I have like never sat through an Arlo. Video. I feel like I I like he's like killing me way too fast in that last phase. Yeah, yeah. Like I feel like Arlo gets a little too down the rabbit hole for me on like Paper Mario or, or like Pikmin or something. I, I just simply don't have it in me. That's fair. Uh, I remember uh, one time uh, some friends were like sitting around and like wanted to watch the fucking Arlo Breath, Breath of the, of the Wild, Wild yeah. Review. That thing is like three hours long and I, I just could not I don't think I could ever listen to that guy for three hours. I need to... I, next time I get on this stream, we gotta, like, keep me from talking about game reviewers. <laughs> I don't mind. I, I think it's fine. It's fine conversation. Yeah, but what if I ever meet these people and that's don't know true. about this video? Yeah, that's the <laughs> weird thing. I feel about talking about these people. It's like, what if... Like, I feel like if... Me they're, they're making fun of them. Stream, like, of course not. It. God damn it. It's like he just kills me instantly. I don't know what to do there. What do you uh, usually do there? I just don't get hit as much. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's not And valuable. then I just keep jumping. I just keep jumping on his head for the entire fight until the last, last phase. Okay, right, when he's, like, about about to start moving again, that's when I gotta, like, save my jump. Yeah. Right. 
I should save my firework for the fucking last phase, actually. Oh, that's so tragic. One time some friends of mine were streaming a Mario hack for 64 and they hated it. Then the creator showed up and said they'd watch the VOD. That's like, damn, dude. Oh, like, God, that sucks. Oh. Well, that's I hope fun. Arlo never watches my streams. Yeah, if, uh... If you ever meet up with Arlo or anything, I have to feel free to take down these videos. I see. I do want to. I want to get a picture with Arlo so bad. Genuinely, like I, I have had plans of this where I would like. I want to go to PAX or something, and fucking like, just like be dress up real nice, look real pretty with it, and then I, I just take a photo of me with Arlo and then post it on social media without context, and that's all. Love. That's but a that's a that goal. Ant, dude. No, not Ant, dude. <laughs> I feel like Arlo has the most power to that. Yeah, for sure. What do you mean, Papa? That's Arlo. True. He's just a, a weird creature. They don't he's even a little know what blue species creature. he is. Yeah. He's, he's whatever species the Muppets are. Isn't one of those a pig? And a frog? Well, but they're all Muppets, so... Oh, uh, true. Isn't one of those a big bird? True! Kinda like an Ophelia bird. Oh, yeah. <laughs> they're kind of the same. <laughs> Green Arlo is British and Sonic fan. It's funny. I love that Arlo has a family of, of colored siblings that are all just. It's like he, damn it all, he man. Could, Arlo could have like a fruit gummy uh, pack of different colored Arlos that are all like this is the orange one and blueberry and red berry. All right. How much more does getting a, a high jump do? Um, a good amount. Like a lot, a lot. But I think this this arena might. Does it have a ceiling or? I don't know. Eddie K. But yeah, like keep trying for the for the big jump. I feel like this is the better strat, to to not do the big jumps and then just do this, and then you'll have the jumps for when he moves, like this. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, this seems to be like, Doing the little bounce on his head doesn't really do anything, but if you do a, a jump on him... A... See, I thought I was doing big jumps the whole time. No, not really. These fucking <laughs> hyper waves, I don't even know. Yeah. Man, this one's hard. If you're too, uh. If you're just not mature enough, you know, you can just pretend you beat the game. <laughs> I can do it.
He always moves before I can get my big jump in. Only brats quit on the final boss of Jumping Flash. One, two, fuck. Armory fail. True. But, uh, Wendy's a little bit of a brat. I'm kind of a brat. I need to be tamed. You're a little bit of a brat with a brat. Okay, weird thing to say. Huh? I don't brat. I don't ever brat. And I never will brat. So, um... <laughs> one and one are right next to each other on my keyboard. <laughs> I'm restarting. I had I had a good momentum before, and I think I know what must be done. Jukes me. No, the the big jumps are definitely tricky. And I think this arena does have like a, some. He kind jukes of me. He loves those jukes. Here we go, here we go. It may not be as effective, but I am getting hit less, so this is working. Yeah, no, you're doing pretty well. You're doing really well. YouTube has become woke. They added fucking pronouns. They add fucking? They added fucking to the comment section? Oh shit! Whoa. Anton sub. Thank you, Anton. What the fuck is happening? Die, 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 please die. Oh, you can't. I did it. You can't. Yeah. Uh, I did it. All right. You're a hero. And it only. It, on, the, for, on your first try. First try. Wendy wins. First try. Barry. Idiot. Lol, that's simple flips. I know that one. Truth, truth, Barry. Truth. Barry, Barry, Barry. Thank you, buddy. Wendy oh, freaking wins. Wendy wins. Wendy freaking wins. Wendy freaking, Wendy freaking wins. wins. Wendy freaking wins. Wendy freaking wins. Okay. Wendy freaking wins. Wendy wins. Baby, 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 baby. Wait, hold on. I'm just gonna put this over here. Well, don't you want to watch the ending cut? Yeah, yeah, of course, of course. Good job. Thank you. The pan galactic? Come on. Like, they say that? They did say that. <laughs> They're friends now. Yay! Let's hear it for our hero, Robin. Yay! I love that these guys just got like normal, like man voices. They're like, yeah. let's hear it for Robert. It's Robin. Well, howdy. Oh, what's up, Wubulus? You mi you just missed the stream. I'm sorry to yeah, say. We're kind of wrapping up. Has been duly humbled by Robin. He'll think twice before reaching out and touching a planet again. As far as his membership in the Pan Galactic Criminals Club, well, let's just say that Kabuki's standing has been reduced to that of a disgruntled Regillian slug bat. And as for our hero, slug bat, damn, that's less than human. Crazy enough to need a high octane multi-dimensional. That's a big tree. Robot. True, that is a big <laughs> tree. It's just a small planet. Yeah, it's little man. No more Whoa, they got Captain Kabuki on a collar. Um, luscious. This is the third game. Could be this. Ooh, freaky. Lol. Okay, well, that was Jumping Flash 2. Wait, but actually, look. You There's unlock extra, extra mode. Well, what's and extra? it's two faces of Baron Aloha. It's just a remix, but it's they contextualize it as like, ah, I'm now fighting with Bar with the Captain Kabuki to kill you, Robin. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah, so but they, it just, they it's just the same stages, it. but they, yeah. 
a man and his galactic sized wife. <laughs> yeah. Aww. That's wonderful. Love wins. So it's just remix stages. Yeah, I think this, like. Oh, wait, but oh, Robbie gets a new voice. Does he? Ready to rock. <laughs> now he's like even more like gruff. Yeah. They changed him again. <laughs> they keep making him worse. No, no. You don't. Need, you don't need to play this, but it is just like. Damn. Might as well just do the first level real quick. Sure. Ready Fucking to rock. see how fast I can do it. Hmm. Oh, I just decimated that kiwi. Aww. Where is it? Oh, whatever. <laughs> well, that was You're Jumping Flash too. I am a bit of a quitter. Sony were really anti cutesy back then. Were they? I don't. I think this is pretty damn cutesy. Jumping Flash. I'd say they were more anti cutesy now than they are back then. Yeah, for sure. Ready to rock. Okay. Well. I think that's it. I think that's the stream. That's Jumping Flash. I'm really glad we finally got to play this one. Yeah, I'm glad you got to play it. I uh, thank you for having me on the stream. Yes, yes. And hey. we will be back again for some nights, I believe. So that will be fun. That's true. But mm -hmm. that's a million years from now. That's so a whole folks... month away. It's a little, it's a little longer than that. I mean, we don't have to do it on Christmas. We can do it in like December or whatever. Yeah. Oh wait, it's true. November. Fuck. Wait. Yeah. We, okay. We're in. Well, then you know what? We don't have to wait that long. We can. Yeah, we whatever. can just play. It'll be. It'll be fine. Uh, and the Thanksgiving special. <laughs> yeah. Perfect. Thanksgiving is kind of just Christmas anyway, so it's fine. Uh, real quick, we do have a little piece of art. This is kind of badass. Ooh. Uh, this is from Bass. Uh, on Discord. <gasps> It's me, Yay. it's you, it's Robert, and we all got our own little Moo Moo's. Moo Moo! I like that you gave my Moo Moo like the slut eyes and you gave Jess's Moo Moo the Jess eyes. And the <laughs> Robert Moo Moo the Robert eyes. That's cute. It's very cute. Thank you so much. That's that's wonderful and adorable. Uh, otherwise, I think. Oh, shit, no, I actually have some other stuff to show. I have some new stuff. This was from the other day. Uh, this was from Psychonauts by Aubrey, uh, in Discord. This is me as a Psychonauts character. I fucking love this. It's so, like, I feel like you nailed the style. You got the shape languages of a Psychonauts character down. I, this yeah, is incredible. This is good. Um, then we also have something from Jenny. Where is it? It is right here. It's me as a puppy. As a puppy girl. I think this uh -huh. is also very adorable. You guys make great art. Thank you guys so much for all the, the art and stuff. As always. This is very sweet. And uh, sorry for it being a little bit short uh, today. But I also have other plans. And also it's just a short damn game. So you know. Hopefully the night streams will be much meatier. Oh well you know we went over two hours. That's That's better than yeah. last time at least. For sure. I think you just sucked a little more at this one. <laughs> Lol. Lol. So true. She is the best girl. Aw. That's so nice. Alrighty, well. I think I'm gonna get going. Thank you guys for coming. Thank uh, you. Make sure you follow Just on Twitter, by the way. At Just Waves Hello. She what? makes great art. I just... I, I didn't have her Twitter to promote last time, so I'm gonna do it now. Just Waves Hello. Give her all your loves. Give her all your loves. Any any final words, Jess? Um. Hello. <laughs> <laughs>